Hello guys, me back again. I, uh, as some of you might know, I uh, ordered a two kilowatt diesel liter from China and got a five kilowatt. So I ordered a new one, and this time I got the correct one, two kilowatt. So in this video I will uh, do a short comparison between the two, so you can see the differences. Let's uh, go ahead. Let's see. This is the old one. This is the. This is the five kilowatt. Ooh, big and heavy. And this is the new one. Kilowatt, nice and tiny. That's it. Let's get these boxes out of the way. And here we go. As you can see, it's quite a big difference. Between the two. So let's take a look at the inside. Okay, then let's see if we can take them out of the corners. How we'll see. And here we have the five kilowatts out. See if we can do the same with the two kilowatt. Oh. And here we are. If you see inside the housing, there are some special uh, tape heat absorbance and heat resistance tapes on all four corners. Yep. Look at this. This is tiny. Let's see if I can make them stand here. And here we have them side by side. Definitely a big, uh, big difference. Make this one stand. No, we will not. There we go. Looks to be the same glow plug and the same thermostat on the heater. Same on this side, at least the stickers. Same uh, plug. Oh, you can't see, sorry. Let's see if I can. We have the same plug. Here we have the circuit board on the tiny 2 kilowatt unit. It's a little hard to say, but it looks to be the same as the one in the 5 kilowatt unit. Seems to have the same capacitors in the same places. The two fans seems to be a different as well of course since the hosting is smaller. So this is smaller and bigger than this one. And uh, yeah and you can see for yourself definitely smaller housing. Two rubbers on the 5 kilowatts. Here it was on the tape on the housing. Inside there, tape. Instead of the rubber. Yeah, and again we can see the circuit board has the same capacitors, same drossels, same connectors, same transistor placement. So it seems to be identical uh, circuit board of them. 
plug here is not really in the bottom, but that's not important. Um, fuel intake, same place. Yeah. Everything looks to be the same, except for the size. In the front, you can see a big difference in the X. Looks to be a more massive one. This is more tiny. Yeah, apart from that, I can't really see any big difference in the casting. The boat seems to be very nice uh, in the finished. In the finish, not finished. This one has some, uh, what do you call this? Grooves, which is from the assembly, I think. This one looks nice and even. Here it has some grooves as well. Five kilowatt looks excellent in the finish. Yes, that's about it, I think. Regarding the holes in the housings, they are definitely different. This one is uh, close to six centimeters. This one is seven and a half. Yeah. Three inch. Two point one inch or something, six centimeters. About the footprint for the exhaust and the intake, it's also identical on both. You can see you can change the gasket and they will fit anyway, or both ways. So, um, yeah, that's also good to know. This uh, fuel intake, it's uh, slightly different on this one. You can see it's more like an arrow shape. This is more like a round bullet shape. Yes. If we take a look at the boxes, which uh, seems to be identical as well. Same uh, fuel tank. And here is the... That's the difference. This is the 5 kilowatt, 2 kilowatt. Hot air outtake. And this box also has the T-split, which of course also is of a different dimensions. Yeah. The heater output tubes uh, vents seems to be identical at the front. Yeah, I would say they are identical at the front. But on the rear, of course, there's a big difference. Yes. Exhaust is the same on both. Everything the same. Silencer is the same. Even the manual, I think, is the same. Yes. The steel plate is the same. Yeah. Uh, there is a slight difference in the wiring. Because on the 2 kilowatt you have this uh, 
big plug for the remote and on the 5 kilowatt you have the small plug for the remote so here I might change the wiring between the two so I will use this wiring for the 2 kilowatt and that for the 5 kilowatt yes tubing same strip Yes. Um, the filter is a big one on the 5 kilowatts and it's a small one. Let's see. It's a small triangle one. Here. 5 kilowatt, 2 kilowatt filter. I definitely like this one the best, so I will use this one. This one looks to be a fuel filter for a scooter, motorcycle, something. Yes, this looks like a more heavy duty one. Same screws, bolts, clamps, usual stuff. And only two hose clamp, like it was with the 5 kilowatts. There's, yeah, you see. Very big. And this small tubing. Same, hot there and take, same. And the air filter, which also is the same. Or maybe not. Let's open and see. No, it's a difference in the air filters. You see, two kilowatt has some extra holes. Both has a, some kind of sponge internal. This one has a lug. This one has a what do you call this one? Slit? I don't know. To mount it. Yes. Done. That should be all from the box. Uh, let's see the fuel pumps. This is the 2 kilowatt and this is the 5 kilowatt. The only difference I can see is the tubing. Same plug. Yeah, I can't see any marks, anything that says any numbers, nothing. So I will say that's identical as well. The red remote is the same. I think there is only one type of those. But the LCD has a different plug. You can see a tiny one and a big one. Apart from that, they look the same. So, this one I will switch over, so I can use the tiny one in my car. That's all for this uh, comparison video. I find it really interesting and I've seen anything, uh, I've seen any videos that has the two 5 kilowatts and 1 kilowatts compared. So to me, this was really useful. God, this one is really heavy compared to this one. Here we have the 5 kilowatt. 
yeah, approximately five kilos. And the tiny two kilowatt. Yeah, around three kilos, approximately the half, which is tiny. So, that's all guys, see you later, bye bye.